when you first start with this program, make sure that you set your resolution right. So make sure this is in inches. Uh, select the width of the project that you want, height of the project that you want, make sure this is in inches, and then this DPI, dots per square inch, is 350. If you're doing something very large, like a banner, then this will be uh, 150. But for uh, something like this, like a business card, you can just click Create, and now this white area is your canvas, and you will just go ahead and just start doing doing your designs on here. And that's how you do it when uh, when you're starting from scratch. Uh, now, other thing is you can just come here again, inches and and resolution that has to be right. Uh, make sure you're on print if you want to do do some of this pre-designed stuff. Otherwise, if you're doing something like online, it's not gonna work. Uh, anything on 72 inches is not good for printing. It's only good for your uh, computer so that needs to be 300 or 350 is what we recommend at the actual size so you can do that and then you have some designs here that they already have in their system uh, we're not associated with the site we're just uh, suggesting as a good option and let's say you want to do this design right here um, and then when you're done so you make your edits when you're done go file save as PSD you will save that as Photoshop file and then that way you can open that again and go make edits and then the file you would send to print you can export as save it as PDF or save it as PNG or save it as JPEG uh, so you'll send two files you'll, you'll save two files one will be saved as PSD that's your original editable files that you can go back and, and make changes to uh, you can open it again and change the phone number and such and then the file you send to print, you'll export it as one of these formats, not a GIF, one of or SVG. Save it as PNG, JPEG, or PDF, preferably PDF. Save it as PDF, uh, and then send the PDF to print. And the PSD is something you'll keep for yourself. You can go back, open it again, make edits, save it, and then save a copy. You know, export it as PDF. And then if you're using a file, if you're using our templates, uh, so you you just uh, download our template and here we are. Then that will already be uh, set up in the correct, see, correct size, correct resolution if you open our template. And that's how you do it, uh, how you set up your files in this program.